anybody that was giving an infection to play with <laughs> Randy, the pilot, announced it to us. He said, hey, guys, we have a flight. This will be a little bit different. And then we found out we were going to be transporting a canine officer. So, yeah, it was definitely different. We bounced it off the handler and said, you know, what, what he wants to do. And he said, anything you can. So uh, IV oxygen and the dressing that we applied to his neck were all standard things we would do. So, but different, though. We didn't know medicine-wise what yeah. to give him to calm him down or anything. So that's a learning curve. Still, too. <laughs> He was never, ever nasty towards anybody. He was scared, obviously. He was extremely, extremely frightened, you could tell. Ty did his hand, did a great job keeping him under control. Uh, the hardest thing was just he was so worked up, was trying to keep him down, uh, strapped in and all that kind of stuff. He didn't want him to get free and back of the helicopter or fall off. I think everything went well. It looks like he's doing well. Did you feel good about it? Yeah, absolutely. Especially the next day or the next day after that when you heard he's still alive and played a role in it. Yeah, it was, it was fun watching on the news getting better each day. There we go. Awesome. Perfect. Sorry.